Yeah, yeah, I've got time. All right, welcome back to the 20 Minute Gamer channel. I'm your host, Nick, and we're jumping into some more Lens Island. I've been having such a blast getting back into this, especially after the update, that we're going to keep this ball of wax rolling, okay? So we're going to keep this up, and, uh, you know, we did something good for the village. I think that's fine, but we're going to go ahead and do something good for us. So I'm going to go ahead and head on back to my little cottage, and we're going to see what we can do. I know that I want to go ahead and get some water. Water can is filled, and... Um, Let's water some stuff here. All right, we don't have any money. We've got limited resources. And I'm going to go ahead and... Where's my toolbox? Weapons, tools, pickaxe. There we go. All right, I'm going to go ahead and chop down some trees. I'm just kind of a... Let's kind of enjoy the process here. All right. I mean, I got to say, as far as the animations go, the animations are really quite exceptional. They're very fluid. They're very... There's great follow-through with the animations. see here you know what I need to do I didn't do it and I really don't want to have to go back to that town but I've got to find out what they need from us and then I need to spend time collecting those resources but I said I wanted to do something for us so what can I do for us it's a great question Go ahead and go here. A fishing pole. What? An iron sword? A simple lightweight sword. What do you mean nothing fancy? That sounds amazing. We need iron shards, but we don't for this. We're going to go ahead and craft this bad boy. Well, we did for that. But guess what? I'm not worried about it. All right, uh, I think there is a place to go fishing. We're going to get rid of that. Yep. Right there. All right. Good thing I live super close, right? Yeah, exactly. We need fish. Yes. Look at that. We got some fish, baby. Nice. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Yep, there it is. There it is. All right. You know what this uh, process reminds me of? Uh, this process really reminds me of if you've ever watched my videos with uh, War Tales. 
But there was a forging process in War Tales that was, uh, nope, nope. Nope, yeah, bring it on back. Uh, there was a forging process in War Tales that was pretty unique where um, as you were forging, you had to strike, uh, basically you strike the iron when this ring of opportunity appears, right? And this just really reminds me of that process. We're going to go ahead and sleep. We're awake. We'll set the bed. Swing our axe first thing in the morning, and then uh, let's go ahead and look at what we can build here, all right? Um, I think that's limestone that we need. Stone in general. Right on, dude. We Guess what? Guess what, homeboy? We got some, uh, we got some stone right over here. I know we do. I know we do. I want these curves. All right, let's find it. <laughs> There's no stone. There's some stone. All right, let's get into it. I'm chopping down a tree and busting up some stone at the same time here. All right, beautiful. running on back so I'm gonna go ahead and put my fire right here you know why well first off we're actually gonna break that down hang on jeez Took me how long to realize I'm using the wrong tool? All right. Get these resources. Hang on here. Awesome. Yo! We're just gonna wait then for it to cook? We go my bad my bad nice so then we can take this cook this puppy down too Awesome. All right. So now, look at that fire. Look at that fire. Where's our fish? A raw sardine. There we go. Look at all that food input. Yes. Oh, that feels good, doesn't it, baby? That feels real good. All right. Let's get back to work. All right, our blueberries are much too small and sour to eat. All righty. All right, if you say so. 
Okay. Um. All right, let's get our fishing pole here. Let's see. Are there any other places we can fish? Yes, right here. There we go. There we go. Really good auto save feature too. Very attentive. I don't think there's any monkfish here, though, is there? Oh. You know, grouper is one of the dirtiest fish out there. Even when you cook it, there are bacteria in grouper that can make people sick that don't cook out. And I know that sounds silly because there's probably a lot of... Uh, a lot of meat proteins out there, but grouper in particular is just a really, really dirty fish. And it's funny because I know a lot of chefs that don't like tilapia. They say it's a really dirty fish and they uh, they don't like to use it. But, um, you know, I, I like tilapia, man. Call me weird. just play this game all day long but I got a job right F in the comments for uh, for those of us that have jobs you know You can only fish in these areas, but we'll experiment. Yo, we got some stuff. All right. I'd like to get another uh, another swordfish, man. Didn't get anything there. That's a bum rap. All right, where's this uh, this cave of solitude here, huh? Alright, so we're back in the cave, and we're going to go ahead and take this slow. I know I saw some creatures rolling around up there, 
I want to make sure that this doesn't end our game right here and right now. Yo, we just got some mushrooms, man. That's awesome. Another food source. Activate it. What is this? I think this is just stone. It doesn't look like uh, coal to me. It was just stone. Same with uh, this. Is this just stone? We got a couple of different things. All right. What do we got here? We leveled up. So base damage, resourceful. Um, gosh. Um, I really think I'm still just going to kind of hold off on that here. I got my sword. So this is all it was. It was just a small little cave. And, um, and you know, that's, it's kind of my fault. I was a little, uh, I was a little scared and, uh, worried. Yeah. Let's light it, baby. Bingo, bango. I was a little worried about the repercussions of going in a cave ill equipped. So looks like, um, I don't know. I'd rather err on the side of caution than not. All right. Uh, but that's cleaned up now. I think that we have the ability to go to that cave that's on the map now. And I'm going to go ahead and keep chopping up these pumpkins because I think they're going to be a great food resource for me. So let's uh, let's see how many we can find here on this uh, on this little island real quick. And then we'll bolt over. And maybe use that second platform. We'll use that second platform uh, flower bed to, um, to plant some pumpkin seeds. For all you, uh, all you girls out there and your pumpkin spice lattes, I don't want to leave you out. I don't want to leave anyone out. I want to include everybody on this adventure so you can see... Oh, wow, we got some polished glass, not even glass shards. That's uh, that's pretty legit. All right. Growing right out of the ground, you thought you were safe. You're not safe. No one is safe from me and my pickaxe. We are going to duck in here real quick bridge Walter you're a water ha got him all right so to upgrade we need a lot of stuff in fact to upgrade I'm gonna need to go over here to this backpack yeah gonna be a long time coming I think uh, I can't promise that we're gonna have this uh, have this little town fleshed out in no time at all it's definitely gonna take some time but I 
I think we're able to go this way now. We mosey on over here. Yes. We're in. We're in like Flynn, baby. We got some coin. We got some more mushrooms. All right, I think we're going to get some uh, I think we're going to get some coal out of this one here. Yeah, we show we got some iron shards out of that one. Beautiful. Just going to harvest what we can out of this and then High risk, high reward, you know? Got our dagger. Our health is, uh, is, is looking all right. light that we'll light this one as well I think there's one over here no there's not all right moving on across here this is where we're gonna have to do our funky little uh roll All right, definitely getting a little bit more on edge here. Uh, I'm pretty sure that during the early phases of this game, I was fighting those onyx creatures already. Full of stone. All right, we're full up there. I, uh, I'm gonna just keep chipping away at these. I know my stone is full, but because these rocks actually have iron ore, coal deposits in them, I'm uh, very interested in getting that material as well. Now, I know we've kind of... Let's see here. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I cannot fight that guy. No dice. Is he following me? He is. He's very interested in, in me right now. Is he still here? Where's he at? All right. We're leaving. <laughs> Say goodbye. All right. Let's mosey on back to our place. Let's look at our resources. And we're going to go ahead and pop smoke on this one because it's been... Just a little over 20 minutes on this, but. All right.
We're also getting hungry. No harvesting in town. Ah, I forgot I was in town. Literally just walked in, forgot I was there. Hey, can I build a plot here? I can! Well, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? All right, let's get some food in us. Awesome. Where's my fish? All right. Cool. All right, so what I'd be interested in knowing is, can I officially build my forge? Is that doable? It's not. I need 10 coal, five iron shards, and I've got four and seven. So that's all right. We're gonna go ahead and break for the night. We're going to go ahead and set our bed, sleep in our bed, and we'll be back in the morning. Thank you all for joining me on this episode of Lens Island. We will be back. I will see you later. Stay safe. Nick out.